guys, it's me, Cindy of Herms Kitchen. So today, I am going to show you how to make an ube leche flan cake. So as you can see, I have ube or purple yam flavor in here. You can get this one in your favorite Filipino supermarket. So uh, earlier today, I made the base already of our dish, so which is the leche flans. So for the recipe of this one, just check on the description down below. So, uh, so I'll just leave this one on the side and I will show you how to make the cake sponge. So before we are going to start, for those of you who are new to my channel, hi, welcome and thank you so much for being here. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, make sure or feel free to subscribe click that notification bell so at least you will be notified on my next video. So let's start cooking guys.
Okay guys, so you will know this one will cook if you will stick the toothpick inside and there's nothing sticking on the toothpick. Uh, this one is already done. So actually when you make this one, it depends on your oven. I am using this work and as you can see I don't have the like temperature uh, in here so what I use is this one this is the oven so this is what I have in here so I bake my cake for 50 total of 50 minutes now if you're using a different um, oven so you can have the temperature over 170 degrees celsius and then like uh what i did i um uh, bake my cake for 30 minutes with the foil on and uh, another 20 minutes without the foil on so it will be depending on which oven you are using uh, like I said I did mine for 50 minutes and after 30 minutes you just put your uh, cake back because it's still soft uh, on the top so it's when you wiggle it it's still wiggling <laughs> <clears throat> So what you can do to check your cake if it's ready, you just get a toothpick, put it in the middle and uh, if you take it out, if there's no uh, uh, cake butter that is sticking, then you'll know that your cake is ready. So I'm almost done. I'm just going to leave it like another five more minutes in the oven uh, off. Uh, so I'll get back to you in a few Hey guys, I'm back. So my ube leche flan cake is already ready. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it off from the oven. So like I said guys, I baked this one for uh, 15 minutes and I have already told you that this will be depending on what kind of oven you are using. But for me, I'm using a uh, work pool. So I, used, uh, I did bake mine for 15 minutes. And so this is my cake. You just have to be careful, guys. It's hot. Okay. So I'm just gonna put it in here. So now this cake has a leche flan uh, inside and the bottom. So what I want you guys to do is just leave this one for like 10 minutes. Just let it cool. Let it rest and then we can transfer this one in our plate and yeah so we'll leave this one for 10 minutes and I will be ready Hey guys, so I'm back. Um, I have already completely cooled down my cake so as you can see I can touch it now and um, I'm going to, uh, you can use your favorite uh, plate. So I'm using this plate and what you can do is you just, oh yeah, <laughs> before I forgot, before I forgot you guys, you get a knife and run the sides of the cake. So when it's done, so, run the sides of the cake. Okay. Yeah. And then, after that, you just get your, your plate and then put it in on the top of your cake uh, pan and then you flip it. So, you ready? <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay, so let's see. Ah, so cute. I have a lot of um, what do you call, uh, sugar, so I just want to heat this pan and pour the sugar on the top. So let me heat it. 
because I don't want it to go to waste because this is the best part. So let's heat that one up. I can't wait to eat this. Right, okay guys, our ube leche flan cake is all ready and ready. I really hope that you are enjoying this video guys and um, hope to see you next week. If you have any suggestions, by the way, you guys, please leave a comment down below, like suggestions of what you want me to bake. And uh, yeah, so I'll see you next week and thank you so much for watching. Bye!